and I'm about to cook. Okay, it fits. So this is my basic. Adorable. Monday. Today is Monday. Excuse my hair, y'all. It's just brushed back and clipped up. If you get to me. Just because I'm just going to get a wax. That's why I'm vlogging on my phone. But yeah, I'm about to get in the car, y'all. I look crazy. I really think it's just my eyes. Or maybe it's the fact. This is what I would look like with no hair. <laughs> That's crazy. I should plan to give me like a facial or something. But yeah, I'm about to head out, go get away. So I'll see you guys on the road. All right, y'all. So I am back from getting a wax and whatnot. Y'all, excuse how I look, but doing my hair between tonight and tomorrow. It's raining like crazy right now here, y'all. So excuse that, but I wanted to get this out of the way before I wind down for the night. So the place where I got my wax from, which is Wax in the City, a great place. Highly recommend. They're just expensive as fuck. Like, fuck. But I did get some exfoliating gloves from them just because I needed some more and they had them. And they was like the same price you can get up for Walmart. So, got that today. And then this came into the mail today. Yeah, excuse the sound. But if you remember in the old, if you watch, hold on, about to come. If you watch one of my older stripper vlogs, then you know that I had seen some shoes back. So I had just ordered some more. And they came today. And these are like the other ones, but instead of being a closed foot, they're open. And of course, I lace them up. But yeah, so here's the boo. I'm hoping that they help me to climb the pole like how I want to. Try this one on just to make sure that it fits because that's why I sent the other shoe back because it was just not a great fit. Oh, should I forgot the music? Okay, it fits and it's comfortable. And as you can see, little shoddy go all the way up the leg. So now we just gotta make sure that I can. Well, I probably can't because the back of my leg just gonna be out. But yeah, I'm happy with them. They're gonna go with a lot of outfits that I have, a lot of looks I wanna do. So yeah, look out for the stripper vlog for where I wear these. I'm probably gonna go to work tomorrow and wear these actually. So yeah, that's that. And then this right here is actually a wig that I'm gonna open to show you guys, but like not too much because it's gonna be in a YouTube video. It smells like straight fish. But yeah, I got a, I ain't even gonna show it to you guys I show it like this. Y'all can see it in the video. But it's a 13 by four body wave, 30 inch reddish, 100%, 180% density weave. So, ooh, and the knots are small. Ooh. I wonder if I should bleach them. Hmm. You're awesome. I don't think I'm gonna bleach them. Just because it's color, it do smell like this. So yeah. So I'm about to chill for the rest of the night really because it's storming so bad. I'm gonna straighten up a little bit. I already got Logan fed and chilling, so it's my turn. I just wanted to come update you guys, you know, because I didn't say nothing after I left to get a wax because it was just a lot. I was I went to the place I usually go to that was booked until 3 p.m. Went to another place. That was like 15 minutes up the road. They was booked until like 30, 45 minutes out. So went to another place, ended up getting lost and finally made it. Then got there and the wax was fucking expensive. But she did a good job. I got my underarms waxed, my hoo-ha and my lower belly. So yeah, 
So I just want to kind of jump in, let you guys know what's going on. So I see you next time. I see you guys. What's up, y'all? Trying to get y'all over at this moment. What's up, y'all? Okay, y'all. So I'm just vlogging. It is currently like 8 o'clock at night. And I'm about to cook. I'm just making us some hamburger helper, green beans, um, and then some cheese garlic toast. I'm about to go ahead and get this started. Okay. Go ahead and meet the cloth. So I need two cups of milk. Measurable. And then one and one third cups hot water. Okay. And then of course we're gonna need one of the flavor packets and the noodles. All right. So my pan is here. And then I'm just gonna season it. Of course we're using the Kinder, the blend. Already know. And then red seasoning and then Italian seasoning. And so now I'm just going to keep cooking the ground beef until that's cooked all the way through. And then once that happens, I'm going to add the hot water, the milk, the seasoning packet, the noodles. Let all that simmer and come together until it's thick. You're supposed to let it cook on like cool with the top on with however many minutes the box tell you to. You do that. Y'all excuse Logan. But yeah, I was singing a song. I don't know what it was, but yeah. But anyway, yeah, like I said, put the top on it, let it simmer on like medium, cool, and boom, you got you some hamburger helper, baby. And I put the top on the um the vegetables. All right, so I'm gonna let that simmer for about ten minutes, and then let the green beans go low and slow as well. And then come back when I come to check on it, I'll put the garlic bread into the oven, and dinner is ready. To All right, y'all. So as you can see. This is my bed and whatnot, so I'm about to clear the top off, and we're going to make it. So y'all get to see what I picked for my first bed set in my new house. So, let's get to it. So, I'm just going to make up my new bed. As you guys can see, number one, it's a queen. But y'all, my mattress is so big. Like, it's tall big. Like, So, the set that I had got for it. It fits like y'all. I love my new bed. It's so soft and stuff. But yeah, the set that I got, it fits, but it don't at the same time. Like it fits across the top, but it doesn't fit to like curve around the bottom. So it just, I don't know. I'll make it work. If I knew that though, I would have got me a king size um bed set. Cause they actually had this set in a king and I could have got it. I like had to work to find this in a queen. So I wish I would have knew that. But anyway, y'all already know that my set was going to be black. <laughs> Y'all know I love the color black. That is just my color. I don't know what it is. Black is just so sexy. So, yeah. So, the theme of my room that you will see when I get done. So, this is my bed set. Adorable. So, I'm going to go ahead and put this on the bed. Just because it comes with a skirt. So, I need to go ahead and put the skirt on. But I'll be here struggling for real. I mean, my furniture is white. But it my bed set is black and gray. And if you do not know, I have a gray blanket from my bed set back when I lived with my mom. But back to the bed set at hand. Y'all, number one, I just watched this video like right now as I'm listening to me do the voiceover. And y'all, I got a freaking full slash queen. I wonder why this thing don't halfway fit. This is far from a fool, baby. <laughs> I needed a, a, a straight queen, so that was my fault. But I made it work. I still had a struggle to put that skirt on. That was a workout. But I got it on and got it straight. So, yeah, period. Your girl did it. All right. 
put the scale on the bed is fucking jeez. But now I'm gonna put the regular comforter up there in the pillowcases and my bed will be made. So this is the bed set. Like I said, it's black and like silverish grayish. I will say, y'all, that little silver gray part, yeah, it's itchy. It's itchy. It's one of them things where it's like, if you need your feet done, baby, you're not gonna be able to lay across this bed. Like, it's just gonna be scratching. Like, no, it's not gonna work. But under it, very smooth, very soft. Y'all, I love sleeping in my bed. I be tossing and turning and just having a ball. Cause y'all, I've never had a bed bigger than a fool to myself so to be sleeping in a queen and have all that room yeah your girl be flipping doing acrobatics and stuff in this bed like i sleep wow <laughs> all right y'all so this is the finished product i'm in love and then of course i'm my favorite blanket i love to have a blanket that matches my bed and then of course i get blinds when I feel like it, here's it from the side. It is pretty high, but whatever. So yeah, bed is complete. And I'm about to finish cooking and get that done so that I can work on my hair. Yeah. So we're gonna put the toast in the oven. And Logan running around. So I'm gonna let y'all see what actually. I'm gonna go ahead and fix plates and then I'm gonna show y'all what it looks like. So I'm gonna let the bread cool down and the other um, green beans heat up because I did not have enough green beans. But I'll show you guys the two plates that are basically done. They're just missing the um the bread. Excuse the sink. Of course, I'm gonna my dishwasher. So we got a hamburger hamper. We got some green beans. We got a little bit of green beans. Just literally one can of green beans. But yeah. And then of course the bread and we got some more green beans. So basically I'm gonna meal prep for I make four different portions out of this meal so yeah so now i'm about to work on my hair y'all it's a mess um if you want to see it I got a wig cap on actually i have to take some water to that side but yeah y'all my hair hasn't been washed in a very long time as you can see it's supposed to be two braids yeah don't judge me we're about to get it right though and i'm going to test out some new product well new to me not new to the world um all right so trying the hawaiian silky shampoo and conditioner then i'm gonna try these deep conditioners mixed together i got a protein deep conditioner and a um moisture and grow it says leave-in deep conditioner but i'm gonna rinse it out with this and then this oil some jojoba oil not the you know just regular old hollywood beauty jojoba oil and i'm not gonna show you guys like me washing my hair and stuff like that just because the first time i do that i'm gonna really have to like figure out my setup and stuff i don't have time for that right now so yeah so i'm about to put the stuff into my hair so that i can let it work its magic and whatnot and we'll go from there i'm gonna let you guys see my hair out because my hair has not been taken care of since i went and got it blown out and trimmed like my hair is pulling the blow out no I put water on my hand. All right, y'all. It 
definitely stain. Okay, trust me. If you see me, he is not that far behind, okay? Yeah, I'm thinking about cutting my hair. What y'all think? I think either I want to shave it down where like, I can brush it and get waves and color it and have fun and stuff like that. Or I might cut it short enough to be like a pixie or to get like finger waves. Or I might just cut my hair to like a bob and then like really do it good and grow it out i don't know yet y'all give me y'all opinions okay so this is what the hair is giving right now of course i'm gonna have to brush it out detangle it oh look at my edges y'all full of product just flying everywhere but yeah so I'm going to wash my hair, figure out what I'm going to do with it, if I want to wear it natural by chance or whatnot. Maybe try a wash and go while it's still hot outside. We'll see. Mmm, my hair is definitely needs to be washed. So, let's make that happen. Here's the finished product. And I'm about to put the tops on the containers and leave one out because I still got to eat. But yeah, so I have a meal, either lunch or dinner for the past three days. Or if I don't mind eating the same thing, this can be a full day's worth of food. Then another day, whatever, however I want to do it. But yeah, I got four meals. Okay, so I had put some deep conditioner in my hair to get it to revert. And I just want you guys to see what my hair looked like. With the conditioner, trying to get the curls back. You can just kind of see how my hair is just all over the place. Some some place, I mean, some places are long, some places are shorter. As you can see, like my curl pattern compared to when I first was on YouTube, you know, doing my natural hair journey and stuff. It's just so much different, and it's like I've learned that the grass is not green on the other side. I missed my old hair. I used to always want hair that you know hung and had loose or curls and stuff like that no i think i'd rather have my thick shrinkage fluffy hair because i could do cute hairstyles like now my hair is so flat and i hate flat hair like that was the whole reason to be going natural so it's just like wow can't win for losing over here but i could win if i like took care of my hair not too much heat on it <laughs> And like, you know, really did it up. But I just wonder if this is my curl pattern, like now that my hair has got some weight to it and some length. I don't know. We'll see. That's kind of why I want to cut it because it's like I can't do nothing with it and I don't wear it because I, I don't like how it looks. But yeah, I just want to show you guys what it's looking like. If you guys go back and look at some of my like wash day videos, you'll see like my hair is just way different now. It's still pretty. Like, I have some pretty curls, but, like, it's thin. Every wash day, I have, like, clumps of hair that come out. Like, I just don't know what to do no more. Besides, I think I'm going to start over. I'm only 24. Like, I have time to grow up at. So, we'll see what I do. Well, y'all. They done took my freaking Snapchat. Fucking haters. Reporting my snap and got my fucking snap so Yeah, I really could cry. Cause that's my money. Like I would fuck. Cause I just can't deal right now. <laughs> All right, y'all. So I got new inventory. So y'all already know I'm unboxing with you guys. I was looking for my box cutter, but I don't know where that's at. What was it? I'm talking to my people. Oh, hey. You put it in about a bag. We ain't talking about it. Girl, you almost got cut. <laughs> oh shit. I had to flip it. How come on, you got so I'm about to 
really get to see it. Cheerios over here. Oh, girl, I ate them shit. Deep ass throat. Huh? It was a little box. So be for real. You bring a little over here? No. I'm gonna go get it. Oh, 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 what I ordered in blue? Oh, I ordered the outfit in blue too? Oh, shit. I don't know. I must have ordered different. Oh, it must be different kind of outfit. Kind of like that. I don't know, maybe. I just be ordering stuff. I ain't ordering shit else to the weather chain. And now I'm giving my little stinky, dinky, thanka, thanka, my doodle butt, my man. Now I'm giving him a bath. I don't even know. I think I'm getting him ready for bed. Yeah. Getting him ready for bed. So I'm brushing his teeth. A lot of times when I wash him at nighttime, I like to brush his teeth in the bathtub. Just kill two birds with one stone. Why not? And sometimes he let me brush his teeth. Sometimes he just want to eat the toothbrush and do it himself. You just never know with Logan. Sometimes Logan, it's just Logan's world. You just let him be. But yeah, now I'm going through and I'm washing him and I'm being very careful because if you guys did not know at this time, he was dealing with like ear infections and about to get tubes in his ears and all that other good stuff. So like I really have to be careful when it comes to washing around his face and around his head, like where his ears are and stuff. Because if you get water in there, geez, something to deal with. <laughs> so just getting him clean, scrub-a-dub-dub. He had a few toys in there, but after a while, he just be like, girl... You don't get me out of this tub. <laughs> so I'm getting all his stuff out the tub and getting his um, towel ready. Letting him jump up out the tub because he loves when I pick him out of the tub like that, y'all. He knows exactly what it means when I bring that towel out. We about to get out. So now I'm putting some lotion on his face. I put the regular like skin sensitive lotion on his face and on his little tushy so that, you know, I'm not using nothing to like give him rashes or irritate him. But once I do that, baby, I'm pulling out the melatonin lotion and it's going everywhere else okay i need this man to go to bed y'all he be running around like he just got off the charge at 11 12 in the morning like logan go to sleep what are you doing my guy <laughs> it's 12 a.m like if you don't go to bed but yes yeah, so i'm putting that all over like everywhere just not where i put the regular lotion at i don't want him to break out or anything like that because i don't know if he has sensitive skin or not we'll learn over the years but yeah, so I'm putting him on a onesie. I finally accepted the fact that he's bigger than a 12 month, but these 18 month onesies are also kind of small, so I don't know. But yeah, I zipped him up, gave him a little bottle, y'all, laid him down, and let him do his thing. Okay. Sleep already. Mm -hmm. And in these few clips, I'm just trying to put my pole up. And y'all, it was a struggle at the beginning, but it was only a struggle because I didn't have no instructions. So I really was just out here just figuring it out. Putting piece one and piece two together. And if that didn't work, put one and three together. If that didn't work, put two and three. I just was trying stuff, okay? I didn't know what the word to do. Because I didn't technically put my pole up the first time. So then for me to take it all the way down and bring it to my house, my mom's house, I was like, I don't know what piece goes where. Like right here, that's so upside down. That's supposed to be going to the roof. Then I realized I was missing the piece. And that was the whole thing. I was like, I can't insert one to three because I'm missing two. Where is piece two? But after a while, and I actually found the piece, I finally got to put it together, as y'all seen by my other videos. But yeah, I was struggling a little bit here. <laughs> y'all so we're going bowling for harmony's birthday so we're at the bowling alley right now i got the kiddos gotta wait logan up 
so when we get in there and we get together i hope that y'all let y'all see the birthday girl and everything else so we call us both our sisters by the way yeah they call each other sisters <laughs> let me go ahead and get this little boy out <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 